All right, okay, all right, okay. Oh, wow, that looks like straight up diarrhea. It's my protein oats, though, boys. Anyways, what's up, buddies? Welcome back to another episode of the 6 p.m. reaction series thing on the main account, the Rich Man account, the whatever account. Uh, we are busy using the lead squad in... Well, Rivals, but mainly EVO, uh, the EVO Lounge, because EA in their infinite wisdom thought having a whole bunch of games in the EVO Lounge where people either just put the controller down or run ultra meta teams to try and sweat the whole game to get you to rage quit was a great idea. But nevertheless, we are having a lot of fun. We're undefeated in the EVO Lounge with this, uh, with this setup, trying to unlock Byram on the main. What I'm actually very much enjoying with running two accounts, the rich man account and then the, the limited time poor man road to glory, is that I'm also running and building two leads teams and they're so different. They're so different, but similar in a way, right? This team, like we've got Jamie Shackleton, um, uh, sorry, the leads team, uh, the, the RTG account, we've got Jamie Shackleton, we've got a super boosted uh, Willie Nonto, whereas on this account, we've got Jaden Anthony, we've got Sam Byram, right? Uh, I think instead of doing Piro on this account, because we're going to do Piro on the other account, we're probably going to do Ian Pavetta on the winger uh, one. I really wanted to do Jaden Anthony, but just to repeat to you guys, EA Sports, for like the seventh day in a row, you frauds, you guys are not allowing me to do Jaden Anthony. Like, I do not understand what the point is of these Evos and the criteria you set where I can't use a player that shows up. He has all the correct stats. He has the right wing position. He fits every single metric. But unlike someone like Piro, where I click his name and I can go to here and, and start upgrading him like we're doing on the RTG, if I go with Jaden Anthony and click him, this has been happening for the last six days. So apparently this has been taken on the servers. The EA forum guys have said they've taken it to the devs. But the, 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 the worst part about this thing is that it expires in eight days, seven days now even, which is even worse. And I, I can't upgrade Jaden Anthony. So there's something there where certain Evo cards you can double Evo, but other Evo cards you can. And that's really annoying. If I can't stack Evos, what the hell is the point of Evos? Taking Jaden Anthony from a dead 72 rated card after this double e winger Evo, he'd be like an 83 and he'd actually be good and so original. How many people are going to have uh, an 83 rated Jaden Anthony from Leeds? Well, what a cool thing. And they're not even letting me do it. So I'm very, very disappointed by this EA. If we can clip this maybe and send it over to EA too, uh, if one of my editors can do that for me, that would be absolutely fantastic. So Anyways, um, that's kind of a, a quick thing. Hopefully Armalika can grab that clip for me and then we can post it to Twitter and get some exposure to this because this is ridiculous, man. Um, right, so in terms of content, it's a Tuesday. So obviously we didn't get new Evos, right? Otherwise I would have seen it and I would have erupted. So we're still stuck on the same Evos, but tomorrow might be Evo day, boys. Uh, last week we got one or two new Evos on Wednesday. We now might be having Wednesday as the new team of the week and the new Evo day. So exciting times ahead maybe tomorrow for Evos. Let's look forward to that. In terms of today, what do we got? Is it just going to be packs? Is that just, is that what uh, a Tuesday is? Do we get anything cool? Well, we did get the Evo Lounge done, so I suppose that's a W. We got that all finished off. God bless. I need one or two more games there. Are you joking? My whole game froze. Can I do it with my mouse? I can't even, oh, I did, bro. For real, man. Right at the start of the uh, right at the start of the video, I gotta restart the game. Sick. Uh, yeah, my game fully crashed, guys. Sorry. Give me a second here. Give me a second here, and we'll reload. We'll reload. Oh, I can't even be excited about what the new content is. Oh well. Hopefully, we get some sort of good SBC. Maybe like a um. Because the games are starting up again, so maybe like a, uh, a showdown SBC. Have we had a showdown SBC yet, guys? <coughs> There's a couple of big games starting up again because the dead international break is finally over with. Um, why not give us like a EA Sports? It's in the game. A Leeds v Norwich showdown. You know, that'd be fun. Daniel Fark going back to his old home with Leeds. Get a Jorginho Ruter versus, uh, I don't know, Timo Puki, even though Timo Puki isn't at uh, Norwich anymore. Chelsea Arsenal is happening. Yeah, that'd be cracked. Showdowns in October. Well, I just don't understand why not. Some Euro showdowns. That would have been cool. But instead, we just got some dead marquee matchups. All right, let's see what the, uh, the SBCs are. I looked at objectives. I, there wasn't anything there, though, right? Um... Nope. 
nope. Let's see. Maybe something got added over here. Nope. These are all the same old ones, right? Yeah. Yeah, and on this account, I don't care to do any of these. On the RTG, obviously, we want to we wanna maximize the grind, but on this account, who cares, right? It's just a content account. All right, well, that's fantastic. So nothing in terms of objectives. That's fine. We got a lot to work with. We have received some good SBC, so I'm honestly expecting today to be pretty damn dead for content. Let's see if I'm right or wrong here. Dynamic Duos! Oh, no, that's the one that we had last time. I hate it here. Oh... I mean, that was cool. That's a, maybe a once a month thing it looks like we're getting. Nothing? Oh wait, is she new? Eugenie Le Sommer. Okay. Oh my. Hold on a sec. Four star, five star. Maybe use her and Diani guys in a squad? Where can she play? Why is she medium high work rates though? That's so weird. Dear God, that is a card and a half. What the heck? Maybe give her a catalyst? Right? 88 sprint speed, 87 acceleration is pretty decent. And then you boost up the passing or an engine or a hawk or a hunter. I mean, she's still taller than Atani at five foot three. <laughs> Atani's so short. Um, right. And then what's the cost? I can't imagine this will be expensive. Dear Lord. Well, if you need somewhere to put fodder, I'm not going to lie. This seems like a pretty great place. If you have a dead in form, 83s are all discard. That's cool. I'm actually not upset with this. I think this is this is cheap as hell. It's worth doing for an 86 bit of fodder. I'm definitely going to do this on the RTG. When I get a dupe that I need to deal with, 100% I'm putting it into this. 86 rated for less than discard. Uh, less than a discard price of an 86 is, is, is absolutely worthwhile. Now the question is, is that all we're getting today? Oh my goodness, it is, guys. Okay, well, good news here. For 6 p.m. content, we've got the hero pack saved up for this account. Because I had a feeling today's content would be pretty lackadaisical. So I thought, why not have us ready to roll with a uh, with a hero? Where is it? And a couple of team of the weeks. And 83 by 2 because that's good. Burr. They got anything in here? Wow. It's actually kind of a, a dead content day. What I ended up doing is I ended up buying the, um, the, the Halloween kit. Can you believe, like, that's what I did today with my life, is I bought a bloody Halloween kit. All right, boys, let's do the premium gold player pack, see if we can get ourselves an Mbappe Trailblazer. We'll do the, um, that's nothing to write home about. That's going to be Ibrahim, who now plays for, decided to play for Morocco, right? Which is pretty cool. So once they switch his nation, that'll be kind of fun for people doing uh, Moroccan squads. You got a bit of a beast in Ibrahim now. Um, these are dead. We won't open those, but we'll do the uh, 83 plus by two. You never know. If your luck is in, your luck is in. Howland again. Odegaard. Hey, not bad. Howland Odegaard squad we can do, boys. Hmm. Very nice. I'm tempted to turn this account into a first owner account, guys. What do you think? The content account? The rich man account? First owner plus Leeds and Cruyff? And Schneider, Leeds, Cruyff, Schneider, first owner. What do you think? Would that even be fun? But then I can't like buy all the cool players I want for this squad for squad builders. So there there is a downside to it. TBH, to be fair, to be honest, could go do that player, but I'm not going to right now. Squad builders for fun? Yeah, I think you guys are right. I think you guys are right. We do first owner every year. I think this account just allowing me to build whatever I want is probably best. That's dead. That might be a dupe as well. No, it's not. I think we have him on the RTG. All right, come on. Get me an informed Sala. Oh my God. With how much fun I had on the with the regular Sala on the RTG this weekend league. Please, can I have an informed Sala? I've been a good boy. This account basically has no good pack pulls. Who's this? I have no idea who this is. 82... Oh, Orsolini! Can this guy be evoed? Wait, can I... Does he have a right wing position? Can I evo this card? Please have a right wing position, sir. Wait, can I evo this guy? 
Can I Evo Ursulini to make him as good as his Trailblazer that costs discard? What a waste that would be. No? Oh, 81 max. Dude, these limitations are so dumb. 81 max, so you can't. That's absolutely dead. All right, boys. Let's finish with the 87 base hero. Like I said, tomorrow for 6 p.m. content should be a fun video for two reasons. First of all, we get a brand new team of the week. I'm hoping we get an informed Virgil. Maybe I get lucky and they give me a Welsh informed Dan James. He had an amazing game, although the Wilson from Wales will probably get the informed. But anyways, so brand new team of the week. But more importantly, if what happens tomorrow happens, and I hope it happens for tomorrow, what it happens is how it happens, is maybe it's Evo Day. Maybe Wednesday's Evo Day, we get one or two new Evos. I'm hoping. Anyways, we'll catch the beauties on the flip side. Imagine I get Yaya Toure on two accounts. Yaya Toure on the RTG. Yerzy, do that. Dude, we have this guy on the RTG. He's actually very good. Yerzy, do that. <laughs> and on that bombshell. We'll catch you beauties on the flip side. Peace.